Hey everybody, welcome back. We are finally, finally gonna take Thurmond. Uh, they have no allies. How weak are they? Incredibly. We can probably take them out with, uh, <laughs> with these guys alone. Um, God, it's so weird that they're all just in one side. There we go. Um, we would massacre them. They're probably largely light infantry anyway. They probably don't really have any pikemen or anything. And, uh, yeah, they wouldn't stand a chance against heavy cavalry. Their land, what does it count as a river crossing between? Only from the north? Okay. Well, we could take them out real fast. We've dealt with a lot of our religious problems over here. Our domain is still too big and people aren't happy about that, although we've largely dealt with it, not completely. Uh, our holy war is over, and it's time we start taking more land up here again, really consolidating power, you know? Oh, and our inheritance laws. I don't think we've ruled 10 years yet, have we? No. I actually don't remember how old we were when our rule started. I just hope we live to 10 years, because with the cancer and everything, who knows? All right, one pause and back to max speed. Oh, uh, right, I was paying a ransom. Um, do we just declare now? Yeah, let's just declare now. Our threat's low enough after all. Um, do we have any cavalry leaders left? Not looking like it. Flanking, I'll put you on the side. Yeah, uh, do you have lead the center? No planes, though. Uh, moral defense. Are, is this planes? Does this count as planes? Um, forest. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I think I'll just take you. Do you really have any advantage over the other guy, though? Not really. No, I think this guy is still better. Move in. Oh, we'll massacre them. Yeah, we're hitting them on the flank and everything, so they're just one big group. They actually have way more heavy infantry than I gave them credit for, but three pikemen. No, they're done. Yeah, the skirmish is... Yeah, it just turned into a melee and a skirmish alone pretty much put them out of their misery. Who are you? Some Polish priest? Bishop? No, you don't even have land. Yeah, just burn the apostate. I don't care. Alright, victory. And what is this? You've you successfully sown distrust. That was my chancellor saying he sowed distrust. This guy is so fucked. <laughs> He's got such a big country. He's gonna have crazy rebellions. He is wickedly in debt. We're sowing distrust. He is doomed. Oh, we don't even have enough people up there to siege. Okay. Bring some local uh, levies in. Who are you? Some single Frankish lady who is clearly a branded apostate. Burner. Gee, it's so hard to find apostates when they're branded apostates. Oh, Jesus. Did my dog bite someone? Totally was attacked one of your courtiers. Oh, God. This guy's like a genius, too. Yeah, genius mastermind theologian. There's a chance nothing happens. There's a chance he gets injured. There's a chance he dies. Oh, my God. I... I mean, I have nothing to click off of him and then click back on, do I? So, I guess I won't know his fate. And then, yeah, combine those local vassals and just siege down the place. That'll be an easy siege. Um, I really want to take Cornwall. Do you have any alliances? Yeah, with Northumberland. Why can I not declare on you? Oh, we have raised levies, of course. It's always the... Really basic stuff, I forget. Wow, and Independence is getting strong again. Did they get another person to join in? They got another a f another few people to join in. My nephew and another vassal. What do you own? Uh. Who are you? Oh, up there. And who is the other one? I didn't even realize I owned this land. Uh... God, these independence factions are becoming a bit of an issue. Um, I understand why. My domain's too big. They don't like me all that much. Lots of little things. Maybe I do need to give away one of these castles. 
I hate to give away a castle, but you know, what are you gonna do? Especially these really developed ones. What's one of the weaker ones? Leon? I think right here is one of the weaker ones, isn't it? Well, it's hard to tell the exact money on these because these ones are getting hit by disease. But I'm kind of feeling like this might be the one I want to give away next. Maybe. Ah, it's hard to say. It's just... I have a lot of good stuff. There's nothing really crap for me to give away, you know? What really matters is that I retain everything right here. In fact, how are my troops? My troops are almost maxed out, aren't they? Yeah, my own personal levy is nearly maxed out, which is worrying. Because that's what really wards off independence factions, is your personal levy being big enough. And your retinue. Speaking of, uh, can I get more? I can. Wow, that went up a lot more than I realized. I don't know why, but it did. Oh my god, I could get way more. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Uh, we just massively increased our retinue. First of all, get off the coast so that you can safely reinforce. Uh, this is going to cost a lot of money to reinforce, so we're going to have to... Right now we're reinforcing at maximum speed. Let's see how much th this cost goes up. A lot. Okay, that's a max speed. It's that much to reinforce if all of them are not at max. Uh, yeah, we'll take care of that soon. Uh, if I put it half speed, I mean, that would take a long time to get to full, though. We'll roll with this for now. But we just really made our army way scarier, which will help ward off independence. Uh, my son is a fortune builder. That's a pretty good education right there. Several rumors circulating with a lot of effort. I managed to discover and trace them back to Savoy. Aren't you in the independence faction against me? Yep. I don't like her. Uh, apparently most people do like her though because an assassination plot wouldn't go well. Look, she's old, she's out of patience, she's stressed, and she's depressed. I don't think she's going to live long. Intrigue focus, and she wants to become the Queen of Burgundy. No wonder she's after me. Spymaster secluded himself in Leon. Fuck, he became paranoid. Dark Day's son is sick. Call the physician. Castle wall's done. Good. Anything to get some more money and some more levy. Victory. And we don't have enough now. Wow, they have a lot, a lot of defenders here. In their, okay. Wow. I wasn't expecting that. Do I even have many reinforcements up here? Not really. Um, We're going to have to ship some overseas. Oh God, this disease ridden hellhole. Um, split. Split. Just send 900 over. That's more than enough, and I don't want to leave home barren, because then the vessels will all be like, oh, he's busy, kick his ass. And you know what? We, we don't need you guys. They'll just piss off more vassals. There we go. Get into a friendly port. An apostate. Chancellor. And a duke. You're German. Sorry, what do you own? That. You own quite a bit. Are you actually an apostate? Uh, he's talented and he likes me. Right, because I'm the one who gave him a county recently. Just brand him. Okay, uh, sounds on hiding, no. Can we? No, I mean, we could do an assault, but we'd have a lot of losses, and that's really expensive right now. 
Uh, formed an alliance. Some of my vassals formed an alliance, okay. And we're finding apostates left and right. To be fair, we just took a lot of land. Um, in the last little while. Oh, well, we know you're an apostate. You're Muslim! <laughs> of course you're an apostate. Um, yeah, just execute him. Maybe we'll get a Catholic mayor next. Uh, inherited other titles of Wessex. Okay. Did we... I don't think we had this one before. Is this one we just took? Yeah. Yeah, it is. That's awesome. That's the best county in the British Isles. I'm happy that's under our control. Whoa, hey, you just got a lot of reinforcements. From Surrey? They called in Surrey. Okay, well, that's worrying. We need more troops over... Oh, well, you know what? I don't think we actually need more troops over here. Um, because these troops are very high quality. Definitely higher quality than our enemies. So we'll actually merge all this together to get those good generals on. God, we have, like, no commanders. Uh, reset all. I want join court of military skill. Wow. Oh, man, there is a real lack of anyone talented. Holy shit. This is pathetic. When you're my best choice? That's pathetic, but it's better than not having a commander. Alright, uh, you're not even my religion. Can I convert you? No, I don't care, really. You're at least part of my religious group. Uh, and I'm not giving you land, you're just a commander. Oh my god, left and right. Uh, you're a German. You don't own any land, so I don't care if you die. And you're possessed, so you know what? Um, granddaughter. Hair, lip, and camp fever. Oh, she's not doing great. Um, duty. That's done the quiet sign effects glitch again. My wife is sick. Call for the physician. We're almost done. Yeah. Okay, just assault the last one. Boom. Just get it done. We took it. There we go. Uh, yeah, I didn't want to disband the retinue. Okay, uh, you can stay there for now. So you, uh, hate my guts because <laughs> I declared war on you. Uh, but I'm your lord, so you better listen to what I say. Uh, because I now own the majority of Ireland. Uh, yeah, we can create a kingdom up there. Um, I don't want that, though. I'm looking for... Ireland. We got the cash for it, too. It's not even that expensive. We can create the Kingdom of Ireland. I'm doing it. There we go. We are the king of Austerius, Germany, Ireland, and Wales. We are a powerful man. I'm only three years off of year 900, which I believe is when the Holy Orders start. Uh, so we got to nominate someone here. Uh, who owns land in here? My brother. I'd like to nominate him. Oops. Uh, you. There we go. Nominating him for the next King of Ireland. I'm sure he's very happy about that. He's also the next King of Wales. And the next King of Asterius. And I need to change the laws on this. So, uh, their problem is someone has a negative opinion of me, which, my god, am I never gonna get out of that. Um, in my dying days, I could go family, because it's diplomacy. Uh, I could go carousing, which I think on a poll was actually the least popular focus, even though I think carousing is pretty fun and useful. It's good for making friends, and honestly, some statecraft might be doing me some good. In fact, if anything, I think I want to stop sowing dissent and start performing statecraft, because we have real issues with vassals not liking us. Statecraft will help uh, improve our relation with our vassals, as will having diplomacy. Family mostly makes your family members like you, though. It's just tempting because it also gives health, and I'm worried about death at this point. Whereas carousing, I can invite them all to parties. I think I'll go carousing focus then. Okay. We're going to invite every one of our accounts that doesn't like us. Oh man, that's a lot. Why do you hate my guts so much? You don't like new laws? 
Uh, you're not going to like him for a while. Too big, wants a seat on council, wants Kingdom of Germany, you're a title claimant, you're ambitious. There are vicious rumors about me. Oh, right, because that lady started vicious rumors about me, which really didn't help. Everyone's opinion of me is 10 lower for the next few years. That sucks. You're going to be the first one I invite to go carousing. I wish there was a better way to invite people to go carousing than this. It's a bit of a pain. Oh, we're family? I don't want to non-aggression back to you. Uh, just in case. Uh, can I not invite you to go carousing? No, my eyes get a little lost on the page, to be honest. Oh, you're too young. Invite carousing, invite carousing. So we're just going to invite a party of the people who hate us most. Uh, I'm sure it'll go great. Oh, you're, you're secluded. Of course I can't invite you and your child. Carousing. I'm also inviting some of the people who don't like us much, but they still like us. Okay, and let's say our wife. Oh no, our wife is, uh, is bedridden. Okay. Uh, all right. We already have all that put down, right? Yeah. Man, we could have a real scary... We can have almost 6,000 uh, troops. Okay. Uh, you are reinforced enough to be able to fend off barbarians and Vikings and stuff, so stay where the hospital is for your own safety. Um, I'm quite happy with this development, though. King of Ireland. That sounds good, doesn't it? Don't know what you're missing? Ah. And, oh, most of them are saying no. Does, is this the guy who hates my guts? No, okay. Uh, no, no. A lot of people are saying no. Oh, which is kind of what I expected. Um. Oh, yeah, and someone said in the comments, like, hey, if you don't want to be always taking care of apostates, why don't you just switch to something like uh, improve religious relations or cultural research or something? And although I, I do like some of these other things, um, I do want the piety from Hunt Apostates, and hunting apostates is probably really important for us because we have all this land and the Muslims are invading and stuff. We really do need to weed out the apostates. It's a bit of a pain sometimes and it puts you in some rough situations, but we got to do it. Um, right, so we have that kingdom. So we're your de jure lord. You still won't agree to... Become, we're your de jure lord. Just because foreign culture and base reluctance, your opinion of me is not particularly high. Can I send you a gift? Oh, you would love me if I did that. There you go. Now you love me. Vassalization. Now you'll say yes. Coming to the feast. You, yeah, should be fun. Sweet. Yeah, see, some people are saying yes to the feast now. Peace be with you. Swear fertility. Okay. And our threat went up a little, but we're performing statecraft and everything. It'll go down pretty fast. So he's our vassal now. Sweet. So we have even more of Ireland. Now, he's a direct vassal, isn't he? Yeah. Which I'm not thrilled about. I think I want to, um, again, I want to make more duchies and delegate more. At some point, I'm probably even going to give away the kingdom of Ireland. But not until I have an empire up here. That would be better. Because if I had this empire, then um, I could just delegate and have the direct vassals just be the kings, you know? Although that is giving away a lot of power, so it's a little iffy, but I can handle it. Um, this is all part of Scotland. Yeah, Ulster is a vassal of Scotland at the moment. As much as I'd love to have them under my thumb. Scotland is... Well, I mean, the queen is quite weak. Because she doesn't own much good land. It's mostly tribal. Um, but she's a tribe. And so she would ask everybody if they want to join a war against me. So it's not quite so easy. We do have a claim on a lot of stuff. Like we could claim all of Ulster. That's a lot of land right now. That's four counties. That's almost the rest of Ireland. I'd love to just eat up that whole big chunk right there. Uh, we could also just go for the County of Ulster, but that's not nearly as interesting. And Cornwall is, yeah, I could de jour all of Cornwall. They're being backed by Northumberland. Um, you're the monster of Northumberland. Uh, between these two, they actually have just over 5,000 troops, which is pretty impressive. Um, now we have just over 10,000 troops, but again, I'm always a little worried about, um independence factions 
Because that independence faction, that's a lot of troops. It's mostly our retinues that are probably scaring them off now is this this rapidly strengthening retinue. Now, <laughs> money could be a lot better right now is because the disease-ridden lands we own and having to pay so much in retinue. But my god, do we need that army and need it fast. Yeah, our tax modifier is not great, but at least it's replenishing. I think we just want to run the clock a little. Oh god, what happened? Roaming the castle, he was very aggressive, chasing several servants, making them flee in terror. Came upon your favorite, uh... Then he came upon the favorite dog of one of your courtiers and killed it. Ah, uh, like steward. I don't blame him for being unhappy, that's awful. Uh, and yes, of everyone... Oh, my cousin? Yeah, I'd rather she become temperate. Uh, join the defensive pact against me? I don't care about the defensive pact. It'll fall apart soon. Uh, so this is Essex. Yeah. Um, I mean, I'd like to eat up a lot of that land at some point. Uh, how much of England do we need? England's the hardest kingdom to create in the British Isles because there's quite a bit of land here required. Um, what do we own? We own 5 out of 27 counties that make up England. We need 51%, we only have 18%. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to bring in some claimants, probably. Unless, oh hey, we actually have a claim on all of Gidwin, which is quite a- Oh no, is that just this? Okay, it's just that, yeah. Sorry, I was looking at this. Um, because if I could have just grabbed up all of that, that would have been great. Uh, any- I don't have- oh, I do have somebody who can claim all of Northumberland, my Corteir here. And you're being backed by Cornwall. Um, in, I mean, if I could just take all of Northumberland, then that might be enough, or almost enough at least, to create the Kingdom of England, and then I could become an Emperor, because I already have Wales and and Ireland. You only need, um, you need three of the four kingdom titles to create the Empire, and I think you need to own a certain percentage of the actual physical land as well. Let me double check that. Empire Britannia. You need 80% of the de jure counties. Yeah, and then you need a bunch of the kingdoms. Um, so of 67, you'd need 80%. So... Uh, you could actually just own all of it but Scotland and do that, I believe. Or all of it but Wales, which is the easiest, because Wales has the least land. Uh, but we have Wales. I'd really like to create the, um, the Empire. Because even though it's not going to be on my main title, like, I really want to control Spain at some point. That is my ultimate goal. It will happen. Um, being an Emperor, just in general, means that I can have kings under my rule. I, you know, kings answer and pay their tax to me. And just being able to do that is very powerful. That means I could delegate this land a lot better. Uh, because being a four-time king is difficult on delegation, as you can see. We're pushing the vassal limit, we're over the domain limit. Which means it's very hard to expand. We need to do a lot of reshuffling of land, and that's... Not easy when you have a lot of vassals who are very upset with you. That's just asking for more people to join independence factions against you. Is this- do we finally have a technology that we want? Because I don't- I'm not thrilled about just spending this all on more legalism. Do I just want more magistry? Piety and prestige. Short year reign. It's just- if you get it high enough, you get uh, imperial administration, but that's pretty far off. Um, I mean, it never hurts to take, like, noble customs and stuff. Just, you know, feudal vassals like me more. It's a very minor amount, but really, you gotta do what you can to make people like you. City vassal opinions, I mean, there's money in that, but it's probably the least important of them. Temple vassal can be pretty important if you're Catholic. Because, again, that could amount to a lot of money in a big empire like mine. Like, technically not an empire, but, you know... It's clearly more than a kingdom. So I think I will actually eat up that last little cheap bit of magistry. Oh, you know what? All these are... I'll do all of those. Those are all quite cheap. It adds up to a decent amount, but uh, I just made a lot of people like me a little bit more. Mm, what's happened here? 
declared a holy war. King of us. Of. Oh, of another place that has an almost identical name. It's getting holy award. Okay. Yeah, they're getting holy award because they're Jewish. And thus, they're not the same religion as uh, most of the natives here. All right. Um, and I was being told because it's one of my people doing the Holy War. Well, you can do it if you want to. I don't particularly care. We've lost our Chancellor. Um, don't have a great replacement, actually. Yeah, you're going to have to do. Sonar Court. My wife died. God. Okay, we need a wife who's really good at stewardship. We gotta deal with this domain. Okay, yeah, keep on statecraft. In fact, you're better than my previous one. We really need that statecraft stuff going. And I really need to marry somebody who is... Wow, this is gonna be my fourth wife? No, one, two, three. Okay, this is gonna be my fourth wife. <laughs> Eight. That's not happening. Uh, I want married, no diplo range, yes, gender woman, you. Would you marry me? Oh wait, no, I clicked diplomacy by accident. I want you. Uh, you're possessed, whatever. You're possessed and ugly. Whatever. Uh, I want to marry you. Teach me your ways! Unlikely to have children is sick. Oh, right. I am sick. I have cancer. Don't I? Uh, might have cancer. Might have a little bit of cancer. Is no one going to marry me because of that? I get the feeling. Most people are going to say no. Unlikely to have children. Yeah. Okay. Getting married might be a little difficult. Uh, I can insta-marry people in my court, I believe. How about you? You're not great, and you're gay, which, well, I guess it doesn't matter, because we're not going to have kids. And you're lustful and deceitful, so you're absolutely going to cheat on me, but no one will know that you're cheating on me because you're not going to have a baby, so I don't really care. Uh, so there we go, we're married now. And my domain limit went up by one! Yay! We have less of a tax penalty. Sweet, we needed to alleviate the uh, tax penalty, because it was really bad. Another castle town's been finished. Good. We need money. Guess for the private seat have arrived. We are now carousing, which means a slight, slight, slight increase to, um, slight, slight, slight increase to our, uh, our natural prestige gain. And some random events might happen. Okay, another castle town done. Good. That's all the stuff I was building right now. So I'm just looking at how this increases. Oh, we got a random best friend. One of the, didn't you hate me? Um... Because now you love me! Yes, one of the people who didn't like me all that much is now my best friend. That's awesome. Some German guy who probably would try and kill me otherwise because he wants a title and he's intrigue focused, so he's probably spying on me. Yeah, call my physician. One of my sons is ill. Well, that was fun. Please. There's a chance we lose stressed, and stressed is a killer. Shit. <laughs> still stressed, still have cancer. It'd be awesome if there's a chance that drinking enough beer while carousing just got rid of your cancer. So a shit thing about carousing focus is you can't carouse while you're, uh, while you're at war. Which is a problem if you get holy war a lot like us. Um, carousing. Carouser. Recently caroused is one of them, right? Yeah. As soon as that expires, uh, in June, we can carouse again. Yes, compensate him with five ducats uh, for taking good care of our son. Absolutely. I want the physician to like us. <laughs> I don't want the physician to suddenly be like, hmm, I think I want the king to die. Uh, okay. I'm just going to double check here. Do I have any, like, castle walls or castle towns that I should be upgrading? Money is a little tight right now. I'd like to have more stockpiled in case of mercenaries being required. However, uh, I gotta take care of my land, you know? And plus, our retinue is ever-growing and very good. Raiders have arrived. Where did they arrive? Nowhere? Right, <laughs> that's pathetic. This group is really good. This group, what the fuck? Um... 
There's not much I can do about that. Look, if you guys get raided, I don't really care. Uh, he doesn't like me anyway. He's part of my the, the people who hate my guts. Also, um... Okay, domain too big is only negative 10, not negative 20 now, because it's only by one. That's good. So everybody likes me by 10 more than they did before. Which actually flips quite a few people from not liking me to liking me. Um, loyal servant, I deserve some recognition and rewards, and that's awesome. I'm really happy that you want the County of Leon. Uh, but I have high diplomacy, so I can say no without making you annoyed with me, so I'm going to do that. Uh, even though I know it would, it would take care of my domain size thing, but I don't want him to have the land, so he can just shut up. We are doing very well. Oh, no longer court chaplain. Our chaplain must have died. We have a very talented replacement. Mastermind theologian. All right, you're the one who got mauled by my dog. <laughs> he still have a high opinion on me. Okay, hunt apostates. I think this is where we end this episode. On the next episode, uh, our retinue is growing very fast. In fact, this retinue... Oh, no, I was going to say this retinue is almost full. And so it will... Uh, I was going to say this retinue is almost full, so it will stop costing me money soon. But no, I forgot this was not one group. This was three groups. And so naturally, yeah, these are both quite a ways off. This is the two group one, yeah. Oh, right, you guys don't need to be there right now. You can go home and see your families and stuff. Um, I think I want the bigger group leading the center. It wants to auto-balance on the side, probably because it's, it's like, oh, but it's high in cavalry. You want it for flanking. Um, I mean, not when the whole army is cavalry, but okay. Until next time, have a nice day.